everybody so today I'm going to show you guys how to move tag to center so this is going to be the first video there's going to be a second part to this that will actually dive into the lookup table and how to find the parameters that we need uh, to fix or change and then also how to uh, fix some other issues so if you want you can skip to that video uh, but if not uh, you can download this script as is and then take it and, and learn from it and use it however way because something you know I want this channel to be just if you don't have to listen to it you can just download the script and use it I personally like that because I'm not a big fan of like the picks and clicks going through each step and having to listen to the whole thing just to know how a script works um, I know how Dynamo works it's easy for me to download the script and then and then tweak it and then have it working for me so that's what I want for you guys to be able to just download these scripts and then use them on your projects because I know how sometimes you don't have time to sit through a 20 minute video just to learn how to do something simple um, so feel free to download this if you want to stick around and watch kind of the walkthrough uh, it'll be pretty fast uh, for the most part the scripts already there so we're not creating a brand new one um, so this is the 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 the, uh, the rubber model you'll be able to download this and it has a bunch of different rooms in it I'm going to switch over to Dynamo and so now with this and I'm gonna okay um, you can see here we've got our, our bounding lines in the background there and that's what these four nodes do here you can see if we look at this there's a list of lines each of those are a line for a certain room <clears throat> And then uh, there's two different methods. Now, the first thing that I thought of when trying to solve this issue is that you can get a bounding box of each of those rooms. And uh, we can do the bounding box of the lines. Now, if we do the bounding box of the lines, uh, we'll have to just change. Because there was an error that it would put all the uh, points down at the origin. And we don't obviously don't want that. but it, uh, I found that if you, if, if the bounding box is that, like if it's flat, for some reason it puts it at the origin. There was some, there was some post about like, um, if that does happen, if that error does happen where it's putting the points, the center points in the origin and not where it's supposed to be, that it could be a scaling issue. Um, I did see that, uh, but that wasn't this case. It has something to do with the fact that the bounding box was flat. So here I create the bounding box and then I reshape it real quick. I use a vector to push uh, the max point up five feet and then I create a bounding box from it. And then from there we just get the bounding box cuboid and then this solid centroid. And then we translate that two point feet, five feet down. Now if we look um, you can kind of see some of the issues so you can see here this shape isn't right this shape isn't right these these are going to be in the next video so these these shapes are a bit more difficult but you can see here uh, the rest or at least most of them are okay except for this triangle one which we can fix uh, by getting the center point of the surface um, instead of the or yeah center point of the actual room the geometry of the room rather than the geometry of a bounding box um so that solves that issue we still have issues with this l shape and u shape room and that'll be in the next video so if those are some of the issues you're having or why you came to this video just check that one out or just download the script um so i'll show you or I'll go back to So that's what that does there, and if we unplug that, I can show you the other part of it, which will fix the triangle room. So we'll plug that in. You can see the triangle's fixed. All the other ones look okay, except for uh, this one and this one. This one's a little bit better or closer, uh, but these are still broke. Um, triangle one's fixed, and what we do with uh, this one is we create from those lines we create poly curve then a surface patch and then we just get the sur or we just create a, a solid from the surface and then I, just like we did down here we do a solid dot centroid and then uh, because that 
the thickness of that is five feet and then that's getting the centroid of that solid here we're just we're just dividing it by two uh, and then it's also a negative so and then we just translate that down and then that gives us our points that way they're in the right location for the rooms so anyways that's really it so pretty quick video and um, the next so you'll be able to download this script and this working file the next video it's gonna be named like part two or just two or something uh, you can download that as well and then we'll have the full script and so I'll try to release these like right next to each other um, so it should be if it's not released the day of um, the second part should be released the, the next day so anyways uh, that's what I have um, definitely check out the discord channel if you like um, it's semi-active uh, and it'd be great to, to start to build the community there you can ask questions I try to actively watch it so definitely check it out if you're interested but anyways thanks a lot for watching hopefully um, if you like the video let me know um, if you didn't uh, but uh, you know definitely like it if you did and then subscribe or whatnot and, and whatever so anyways I'll see you guys in the next video